um, you know, I guess we're getting into more of the realm of anecdotes here, but some growers, well, there's two, there's two things that I've heard from growers. One of them is a myth in my opinion. And that's that sulfur levels like that are, uh, kill soil biology. And I just don't think there's any evidence of that. I mean, soil, soil microbes need sulfur. Um, and there are certain populations or certain species that actually prefer high sulfur environments. You're, you may, you'll see a shift in the, in the population profile, like you will with any management action that you take. Um, but it definitely doesn't kill microbes. I think that comes from the idea that there are a lot of fungicides in organic production that contain sulfur. So there's something called the Bordeaux mm. mixture or lime sulfur. Like it's a, it's a great fungicide when topically applied to the leaves, but it's in a totally different, it's completely different chemistry in those products versus sulfur in the soil. Um, and at a hundred PPM, it's not toxic. It's not caustic. It's not, I don't understand the functional mechanism in which it would kill microbes. And, uh, I, I, you still see microbial action. I don't have a microscope. I don't use a microscope, but you, the, the microbes are clearly thriving based on a number of other metrics when you use a lot of gypsum. So I do not believe that the 